The Professional E-Hailing Drivers and Private Owners Association says it is in support of the Lagos State Government's new regulations on e-hailing transport operations. The association at a press conference explains that it will ensure their security and protect their interests as against the alleged unjustifiable treatment meted at uh, them by the Uban Bolt, the two dominant e-hailing companies. Jacinta Obiuko reports. We are tired of Uber and Bolt. They are just causing a lot of things in our life. When you say a professional driver, it's a job. We choose to drive, go to U.S. You can see that there are some of them are doing this job and they are making a lot of money. Why in our country? Then we cannot just, we can't eat three square meals any longer. I am a woman. I have children. Professional e-hailing drivers and private owners association, PEDPA, is said to have thrived among every other associations to become a voice to reckon with, to jointly have a common ground and formidable body for all drivers. It is a standing rule, of all, standing rule all over the world that whoever is rendering a service should be the one to fix the price of his service. The fact that app companies are the one dictating the price of the service being provided by driver on their platform allow the app company to keep slashing down the fare of the service at the detriment of the drivers. I'm a female driver. I've been driving for almost two years now. And as an ex-banker, I lost my job. And I have a car. Fine, let me drive. But it's not what we started with that we are that is obtainable now. No health insurance, no, I mean... No uh, soft loan, nothing of sort. Several times, I will sleep on top of Milan Bridge when my car has issues. Nobody to call. They we don't have, I mean, uh, towing vehicle. Nothing from them. In a society without regulation, we have insecurity. We need security in our life. We need security in our business. And therefore, Pepta Pe 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 is fully, fully, fully in support of government regulation. Trade Union Congress representatives at a press conference stated their collaboration is of good benefit of the association. PEDBAF has affiliated with the TUC and it is expected. Or what we are going to do henceforth is to protect their interests. The issue surrounding new guidelines for the regulation of e helen taxi operation has now been put to rest following a meeting between the Lagos State Government and the representatives of the e helen operators in the state and will take up from August 27, 2020 instead of August 20, 2020 initially announced by the government. Jacinta Obiuku, Plus TV Africa.